Hello guys, it's Lily here and today I am going to be doing a really quick and easy fall makeup tutorial and um, this is just the look so if you like the way this looks keep watching um, and I just wanted to make a quick announcement which I think all of you have already noticed if you know me um, I got bangs last week and I absolutely love them. I feel like they're perfect for fall and I have straight hair and it grows literally straight down and so my hair is always in my face so I always would have to tuck it behind my ears but like that doesn't really look that cute and so um I would always like put my hair up in a ponytail or a bun or something but then I always had my hair up and I was like I kind of want to have my hair down sometimes um and my ears would literally hurt after like all day if I had my hair down because I'd have to tuck it behind my ears and I have sort of thick hair so yeah, I absolutely love these bangs. Um, I'm still getting used to it. I definitely look like really different with them. But yeah, so, wow, my voice just sounded so weird. I was like, well, yeah. <laughs> um, so I just wanted to say, yeah, I'm super pumped for them. And um, if you guys had any big like life changes, like cutting your hair, which isn't really a big life change, but, or anything just like super exciting that you're happy about, little, small, like it's pretty little cutting your hair. But, um, yeah, just, uh, write a comment down below, anything exciting that's going on in your life. Cause I feel like fall is just like, I don't know, it's like a transitioning time with like new things happening and everything. Um, like we literally got a puppy yesterday. Well, not like a puppy. She's like two. We already have a two year old dog and she gets really lonely when we leave and stuff, so we wanted her to have someone to play with. So, like, yeah, there's two really exciting things that happened in my life. I just thought I'd share. Um, so, yeah, just comment anything exciting that's going on in your life right now. And I'm going to stop rambling on and on, but I could, uh, <laughs> I could talk to you guys, like, all day about life and just exciting things because I like talking a lot. So yeah, I'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna get on with the video. But yeah, this is just, oh, just one last thing. This is just like a super quick, super easy kind of makeup look. Cause I feel like so many fall makeup looks that I watch, I'm like, oh, that's awesome. But that would take me like 30 minutes and I don't like to spend like 30 minutes on my makeup. And I also like like really simple makeup. So, um, so yeah, hopefully for you guys that like quick and easy makeup to do, so you don't have to wake up like an hour earlier <laughs> just to do your makeup. Hopefully this will encourage you and give you some good tips and tricks for nice, quick, easy makeup looks. <laughs> okay, so first thing, I'm just going to pull back my bangs because I I have like, it's called fringe, I'm pretty sure, type of bangs. So it's like, they're kind of thin. So you can like still see my acne and stuff um, through them because they're so thin. And so I'm just going to be putting makeup on my forehead too. So I'm just going to pull my hair back. Um, so first I am just going to be starting off with the Porefessional um, by May Benefit. And this is just an amazing um, primer that makes your pores like disappear. And my skin is really bad right now. Like this is like the worst it's ever been because um, I ate really crappy this summer, like super crappy, worse than I ever eat. And um, I've been eating really healthy and I've lost some weight. Um, but your fat actually stores toxins. So when you lose weight, um, the toxins has to come out. And so it's definitely coming out through my skin. And they say when you eat unhealthy, once you start eating healthy again, it takes um, the same amount of time that you were eating unhealthy to detox. So like if you were eating unhealthy for three months, it'll take three months for you to detox like normally. That can change sometimes. So I just applied that to like my chin where especially I have a lot of stuff going on and um, some to my forehead and especially my nose and like that kind of area because I have a lot of... Um, I have a lot of blackheads and stuff so yeah and like everywhere pretty much my skin is bad right now like my temples like it's not great so I'm just gonna put that on so that um, the rest of my makeup has a nice base and it just fills in all the bumpiness <laughs> okay so now I'm going to be moving on to my concealer and this is from Tarte and this is just their shape tape 
in the color light. And this stuff is pretty awesome because it's pretty natural. No, like, mineral. They don't really use mineral oil or parabens. I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. Um, they just use a lot more wholesome products. There are definitely oh, there are definitely more natural brands, but this is definitely better than your typical makeup. I'm just gonna grab a sponge. Okay, and so I just used my finger, but now I'm gonna just use a sponge. I got this at Ulta and it's just like by their brand. It's nothing like special, but it works really good. And I'm going to just be applying this to some pimples I have around. And um, yeah, I don't really use foundation much just because I have freckles and I like them. And I don't really like to cover them up. So I usually just use like foundation. I mean not foundation. I just use concealer. Um, and I also like to let my skin breathe. Especially when I'm breaking out and stuff. Which is I feel like my skin also reacts all, like badly when I use foundation. Because it's just clogging my pores and everything. So it's really awesome just to use a more natural concealer. Because then it's not getting all these like chemicals in your pores and everything okay now that it's all set let's move on to a uh, blush that's next so I'm just taking my blush from Tarte and this <laughs> this I got for my birthday actually um my birthday was September 23rd and um Sephora if you're like a I think they call it a beauty member or something like that you know one of those cards um they give you a free gift for your birthday so I went in and it gave me this super pretty blush it's in the shade party and I think it's a custom shade for like that they made for the birthday thing this year so if your birthday is coming up and you aren't a member, you should be one so that you can get some free awesome makeup. So yeah, like I said, it's like this nice kind of, I'd say it's like a rose kind of color, like a kind of tan rose. Like it's not like a bright pink, but it's a really pretty color for fall because it's not like boom, but it's just, you know, gives you a little bit of flush when you're getting pale because I definitely, it's crazy how. I'm already getting really pale. So I just apply that on the apples in my cheeks and then kind of blend it out and up. Just a nice kind of, I'd call it a dusty rose. That's what I'd call it. I was trying to think of like a, like what I'd call it. Um, oh, and this brush is from, I just got it in a pack from Forever, Tw Forever 21, but it's actually really soft and I love it. I've had it for years and it still works great and like the hairs haven't really fallen out or anything. Next, I'm just moving on to mascara. And this is the one from Organic Wear by Physicians Formula. And like I said, I really try to use natural products. And this is an amazing um, organic and uh, just really natural beauty product. And it's really hard to find good organic mascara. Because I've tried a few different ones and like a lot of the time they just melt off your face. But this one works really good. If it's super hot and you're sweating it will like come off. But on like nice fall days it's perfect. And I feel like it actually is a lot better for my eyelashes. Because I have one from Urban Decay. I love it but it's waterproof and it kind of makes your eyelashes a little crunchy. And I feel like when I'm taking it off it like it makes them break sometimes like at the end of the day when you're taking off your makeup whereas this like keeps your eyelashes so like nourished okay so that is just one coat on each um each side and now I'm just gonna move on to eyebrows and I'm taking this professional natural lash by covergirl and it's just clear mascara and I don't use it on my eyelashes I actually use it on my eyebrows and I don't normally fill in my eyebrows because they're already pretty thick. So I feel like when I fill them in, it looks like, I don't know, it's just too much for me. I kind of like the more natural look for them. And they're already pretty full and dark. So 
I just usually apply this because I have very long eyelashes. I don't know if you can, I mean, not eyelashes. I have very long um, eyebrows. And if you see, like, they can go crazy. And so I like this because it just keeps them in place all day. And so I'll just apply that to both sides. And I kind of brush over and a little bit up to have that nice, um, that nice arc. And then I wait a little bit for them to dry. And while we're waiting for them to dry, I will move on to lips. Just using the Jean. Oh, how do you say it? Arundel? Arundel? This is in the shade Luscious. And this is just such a gorgeous color for fall. I'll show you once I put it on. Um, it's just like a lip crayon. And um, I just love the color. It's like perfect. Okay, and then that is just the color, and I don't know. I just find it absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I think I got some lipstick on my teeth a little bit. So a way to not get lipstick on your teeth. I'm guessing you guys have heard of this hack, but you just go like this, and it gets all the um, product that would have gotten on your teeth on your finger instead of your teeth. Oh, and so now that I've done my lips, now I'm going to go back to my brows and just comb them out with a little spoolie and just kind of shape them to exactly how I want them and I feel like this is just a really nice natural way to do my brows and it's really quick and easy and just keeps them in place. So um, I thought it would be nice though just to wear some brown eyeliner and this I don't even know what brand this is from my mom like gave this to me but I'm just gonna line my eyelids I mean not my eyelids my eyeliner I'm just gonna put on some eyeliner so that is the finished look now I'm just going to put on my makeup setting spray from pure bliss and this is organic um, setting spray and dude it works so good like it makes my makeup last so much longer than it normally does so I'm just gonna apply that Okay, and I do this all the time. I always forget to put it on um, before I put on my mascara because sometimes it makes my mascara kind of run like it just did a tiny bit because this is not waterproof mascara. But like I said, it's so much better for like my eyes and just my eyelashes and everything. So yeah, okay, I'm just gonna take off my headband. Okay guys, so this is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed and um, got some tips on like maybe some good products to buy or maybe just using makeup you already have like how to make a just nice kind of natural fall look for just like apple picking, grocery shopping, hanging out with friends, brunch, like whatever. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos and I'll see you in my next video.